Drive to left. He has another one. Put on a show, Byron Buxton. I get the energy going through the through the dugout is uh, something fun for me. You know, it, it gets me going. There it goes. He's done it again. The amazing Matt Carpenter. Honestly, you know, every day I come to the ballpark, I'm just trying to execute whatever that role is for that day. Some days it's a big pinch hit spot. Some days it's, you know, starting, and some days it's kind of a late one like today. But, um, you know, just trying to execute whatever that role is, come out, uh, prepare every day like you're going to play. So when stuff like this happens, you're ready to go. The Phillies have won nine consecutive games for the first time since 2011. Anytime that you can get more runs and separate uh, the distance between you and the opposing club, it's going to make everybody feel better. It's going to make the managers feel better. It's going to make the bullpens feel better. It's going to make, make the fans feel better. You know, so <laughs> any times that you can score runs, period, man, it, it's, uh, it's a good thing. Nick Castellanos knows what he is talking about, Kevin, and I have to admit I was absolutely wrong. I said firing Joe Girardi in the middle of the season was not going to fix the Phillies' woes. And while it may not be all because of that, I was certainly wrong in thinking it wasn't going to have any change at all. What do you make of the job that Rob Thompson has done and also this winning streak that the Phillies were on under him? Sometimes a different voice is part of what we do, Alana. And when things aren't working and things weren't working and that this team was just once again doing the same type of thing they've been doing, hey, change is good. Dave Dombrowski didn't wait around. Give him credit. And this is what to do. Joe Girardi understands the business. It's not the first time you're hired to be fired. When you take these jobs, you have to win. And Robbie Thompson, man, I tell you, he's been around a long time. He's a lovable guy. Now his voice, he gets to do it his way. And, 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 and this is what happens. You know, and this is a really cool thing. You go out and win your first eight straight, like awesomeness. I, I, I don't know why it is like this. It's the same group, but sometimes change. It's like that different voice when you're a parent. You try and tell my kids how to hit, but yet if they look over and get another voice, like, oh, yeah, Dad, well, uh, you know, he said, uh, you know, how, or Clay Buckholz said to do it like that. Clay Buckholz, he couldn't hit, but it's just a different voice, you know? So this is an example of, hey, Good job for the Phillies getting back to 500. Yeah, maybe if Cash tells you to uh, shave the mustache, you'll do it since Karis already doesn't like it. So maybe a different voice will help you guide yourself <laughs> in that direction.